Hey what's up YouTube, Samsung today added two more feathers to their very popular Galaxy series of phones here in India, the Samsung Galaxy J7 and the Samsung Galaxy J5. We already made a dedicated video of the J5, you can check out the link in the cards but now I'm going to give you a quick look at the hardware and the user interface of the J7 which is definitely the bigger and the costlier of the two. You have a 5.5 inch Super AMOLED screen here with the same resolution of HD. Um, as the J5. You have a 5 MP camera here and then a 13 MP autofocus camera here but now you have an LED flash on the front so your low light self is going to be a breeze. Now the screen actually uh, is glossy but not that glossy um, you know to attract all your fingerprints. It's kind of somehow uh, keeping a check on the fingerprints and greases that it should attract. So even if I go and deliberately press my fingers on the it does attract but not as much as I suspected. Uh, you have the usual area of buttons here on the front. Uh, here you have the volume rocker. Below you have the mouthpiece, the micro USB 2.0 port and the 3.5 mm jack. The power button and then nothing much on the top. Behind, as I showed you, the 13 MP autofocus camera accompanied by an LED flash, your speaker grill and duos, meaning this guy supports a dual SIM. I like the feel of the back flap here. It has a very nice plastic matte finish. Also has a shimmering white, uh, you know, whitish kind of a, um, you know, matte -like white kind of a uh, finish here, which feels nice. Also, it won't attract fingerprints and creases that easily. So you can open the back flap here and once you open that, it's not very thick, but will do. You'll see uh, you know, places for both the SIMs and then uh, your micro SD card slot. This phone supports LTE and it also hides a 3000 mAh battery. The micro SD card here supports a maximum of up to 128 GB of storage in addition to the already present internal 16 GB. This guy is powered by 1.5 GHz Snapdragon chipset and has 1.5 GB of RAM. So uh, apart from that, uh, what else? Well, I like the look and feel of the device. It's slightly on the heavier side, just over 170 grams, mainly because of that uh, big battery, but overall fits nicely into hand. You have this nice you know, aluminum uh, color ring on the side that kind of separates the front and the back, which look makes the phone look slightly slimmer, also gives a premium touch to the phone. However, uh, note that this is also plastic, it's not metal. Another good thing about the J7 is that uh, the phone is powered by the latest Android Lollipop 5.1.1. There you see, uh, Galaxy J7 there. If you're gonna go and check out the storage, which is uh, just under 11.5 GB of uh, free storage, uh, it might differ when you get your Retail unit because uh, this is definitely not the retail unit, it's a pre production unit. So, you also might not get all the apps here, but then you'll definitely get the usual Google Android app plus your Microsoft apps and 100 GB of OneDrive storage. Also, the usual um, Samsung in house apps. And the Game Zone app here is of particular interest to us because uh, you will get up to 3200. INR worth of gaming credit when you download various games from this particular app. Now when you go to the app here, I'm going to show you once you load, you get um, four games, Asphalt 8, Modern Combat 5, there you see, Asphalt 8, Modern Combat 5, GT Racing 2 and 6 guns. So your 3200 INR of credit will be spread over uh, the game here. I'm gonna tell you in detail that in a separate video. You also will get the, uh, the Spider-Man Unlimited free, but that credits won't be applicable to this particular game. So you'll have to download, you have to you know click that, and then you'll have to um, you know um, go according to what the screen and the instructions tell there. Yeah, the usual apps, quite smooth, the user interface. And that's the 13 MP camera there, which is quite snappy as you can see. It's very, very snappy. Wow. That's almost zero lag. So you have your usual uh, modes here, your FX and then the timer and then your flash settings and then some of the other settings. The back camera records full HD videos. You can start your video from here. You can pause it. Yeah. 
and then you can take snaps while recording video and you can stop from there also that's the front camera just toggle it it's very very bright also lag just a tad bit not much the 5 MP camera yeah so you also have some modes and um, you know various mode that you could also see on the S6 a pro mode and then you also have a continuous shot mode and panorama and all the pro mode is where you can uh, customize various things like your metering and ISO and white balance and also the exposure compensation scale I'm going to show you some image and video samples in a separate video so you can uh, check that also this guy has a super AMOLED screen which meaning that great wing angle you can see from almost 180 degree even from about 170 degree you can actually see what's happening on the screen the screen does not change color and that's the beauty of a super AMOLED screen possibly the highest technology or the brightest and crispest you know color rendition of a screen that you can have in the industry right now so guys that's a quick look at the samsung galaxy j7 it's going to be available for 15,000 very very shortly it's already available in china so two main uh, advantages that come with both the j7 and the j5 you have the led flash on the front camera and also you'll have 3200 of in uh, 3200 indian rupees of gaming credit that comes through the game zone app in partnership with our uh, game loft thank you